Thursday, March 6, 2014, Singapore, Topayo. Around 80 to 90 percent of Singaporeans live in apartments, and so it's very difficult for them to keep a large breed of dog as pet. The regulations prohibiting large breeds of dogs being kept as pets in landed properties as well. For example, the presa. The presa is considered by the reg regulatory authorities as a dangerous breed due to its size actually. And since most Singaporeans have been brought up without access to animals, Singapore being an urbanized country, many girls, even teenagers, scream whenever they see a large sized dog like a prisa or a Tibetan, ter Tibetan Mastiff and so this is the reality of Singapore so in such cases it is very rare very rare to see large breeds in Dwapayo Bats which as you can see is almost 100% apartments and more apartments so I was surprised to see this presser but this presser lives in a landed property and she is 9 years old, female, and as you can see from the videos, the other videos, she, she had, she is one of the gentlest very So never judge a dog by its size or a book by its cover. As uh, you never know. You can see all the high rise high rise the new blocks here going to the 40 stories and the others new ones as compared to this will be one of those older ones over 40 years old or maybe 50 and the subway is just there so this is a very very uh, central location to downtown so then we see an expatriate lady in this um, heartlands although some Singaporeans might be dyeing the hair blonde so you can't say that they are Caucasians it's a fashion nowadays for the youngsters consumerism is very high in an urbanized city there are just too many things to buy especially for retail therapy March 5 2014 Papayo Singapore